Thank you. Uh, send us some questions. So yeah, we're gonna answer them. Obviously, Nidhi had one there first, didn't you? Yeah, right. If any celebrity in the world knocked on the door right now and said, "Give a kiss," give a snog, give a snog, give a snog. Who would you want yours to be? Ooh, that is a good question. That is a hard question. Is it? Is it though? Harry Styles. <laughs> Someone off TikTok. Uh, Should we predict who everyone's is going to be? Yeah, well, you know, anyone be predictable and say the BC again. Do you know what the I mean? BC. Yeah. Yeah. If you know the BC, if you know the BC, you know the BC. What? The BC. Do you know why? Really the BC is fucking the BC. The BC of the chase. Who's the BC? If you had to snog one person at the chase, who would it be? The BC. Bradley Cooper. The oh, BC. Wait, okay, okay. Is Harry Styles surely? Yes. Neef. Mine would maybe be like Giroud. Ben Shepherd, huh? Giroud. Do you mean Giroud? Giroud. Giroud! <laughs> <laughs> the footballer. I can't. He's so fit. He was like very the sexiest footballer. And yeah, I'm not yeah. Wait, was he the one that we thought was fit when we were watching that? Yeah, match yeah, yeah. Was yeah. Wait, even after 90 he's minutes, he still looks taller. Uh, uh, yeah. Maybe uh, Frank Lampard. Shut the front door. Out of all Frank the men in the world. Out of all the, the footballers. <laughs> no, not Frank Lampard. Oh, maybe a footballer, actually, yeah. yeah. I mean, maybe it, uh, it would actually just be Bradley Cooper. I should just snog with Bradley Cooper. I bet he's like an old man. No, he's not. He's like, don't No, I know who I know. Wait, sorry, just before. Do you know how old the Dark Destroyer is? No. 52. Yes, it is. 52. 50. 56. 60! No, he's not. The Dark Destroyer is 60. He looks good for you're, me. You're yeah, watching you're this. You're looking really great. Who I would Shawnee actually Ball. pick, right? Who I actually really like? Stephen Mulhern. <laughs> Stephen Mulhern. What's a kiss? Steve Madden. Every time he's on TV, I'm like, I fancy you. No. Stephen Mulhern. You fancy Stephen Mulhern? Yeah, I just think he's funny. If you, this is another question, like, what celebrity, like, what, like, at what point do you ask a celebrity for a photo, like, in the street? Like, know, how famous like, do they have to be? Like, and also, when they're sat eating dinner, you were, like, sober <laughs> walking down Northumberland Street, like, who would it take for you to have to, to ask for a quest? For I, was in, I was in V first, and I watched, and there was this, like, YouTuber who was really, really small. I think he's still quite small, and I asked him for a picture. He'd love that though, I feel like he'd Yeah, yeah I think he'd yeah. love it. Like, you lot would love it. So was small like... as in, like, on YouTube, I thought you meant physically. <laughs> he was really small, but he had 3 million followers. <laughs> oh my god, someone came up like... to us on North on the street, it was like, can I get a picture? I'd be like, yeah. I feel like it would have to be someone really big for me to go up to them and ask for a photo. Uh, I don't know, that's a good question, Boss. Maybe, like, it depends how much you like them. I think if they're a small YouTuber, but you've been watching them, then yeah, it's like... Yeah, true, true. Who's the most Instagram. famous person we've all met? Oh, that is a good one. Oh, do you want to know who I've seen in the airport, Bernie K? So, like he's a bit of, a bit of me, you know. Um, I met Ed Sheeran, that's pretty famous. Yeah. Thank you. I've literally got a selfie with him. I've met, um, have you actually? Yeah. No, you haven't. Nope. Uh, no, she has. I've met Wait, have you actually? I've actually met Ed Sheeran. When? When? A book signing. Oh, uh, she didn't bump into him. I met. Wait, I thought you were having me on there. Charlotte G. Shaw, Holly G. Shaw, <laughs> and Sophie. Calm down, calm down. Yeah. Did you meet Andy Carroll? I've met Gaz G. Shaw and Jamie G. Shaw as well. Who? Andy Carroll. <laughs> yeah, I've met him. Do you know who I've met? Lottie Tomlinson. Oh. She's not that famous, really, is she? Who oh, isn't she? Blue Tomlinson. I've met Kimberly yeah. Walsh. I've met James Arthur. I've met Cheryl. Sure, I've met James Arthur. Pixie Law. No, you haven't met Cheryl. Cheryl rang me the other day, which I was working at Boots. <laughs> and then she <laughs> rang me up. Like, it was mad. Do you know who I've met? Who? Hey. You know this song, Teenage Dirtbag? Yeah. Weeta. The main singer's my dad's cousin, so obviously I've met him. Wait. Oh, yeah, I remember you telling yeah, us about this. Oh, no, I'm mean, not staying this mum, doesn't matter. That's fine. Right, everyone close your mouth and eyes and ears and <laughs> nose. Actually, can I have a mouth? Do you mind? Please, Yeah. Thanks, Holly. Oh, sorry, guys. Ooh, it's Elmer. Elmer. Oh, no, Elmer. Oh, no, it's not. It's fucking Elmer. <laughs> so I was going to say, oh, we're not. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I saw this TikTok. Oh, here we go. <laughs> guys, you're going to be laughing when I have the biggest glow up ever. 
<laughs> you put, right, this is what you do. You put moisturiser on, which I've already done. Right. Then Go you on. get some powder. Do you, you put, put it on. over the moisturiser? Yeah. I've heard about this. Then. Oh no, wait. I have seen this. I'm going to do it bit by bit. So you put your powder on. Like so. <laughs> like so. I feel like I'm a beauty guru. I have proper dry skin. I feel like that would not be good for my skin. I've been doing it for work and it's been my makeup last. You should put moisturiser and then a bit of powder. Then, then you set it with setting spray. And then you let it dry and then you put your uh, primer on. Oh, well then. Come on, sent in. What is your favourite memory from uni? That is so hard. That I feel is like we've yeah, so hard. Yeah, like... Let's do one from each year, maybe. Oh, okay. yeah. Oh, no, that's a lot. Sure. No, that's like first year. Oh, I don't even know. Oh my god, so many from first Literally. year. Literally. Third year. I think turning up in first year with my mum. I don't know. Third year, maybe like fight nights were always good. Yeah. yeah. Cozy, cozy like, do you know with third year though as well? When we came back after the first lockdown was like so one of the best yeah. times like ever. Like yeah, so that's yeah. Yeah, so fun. Yeah. Like that night that me and Vic found our dish, found out our dish oh, results yeah, and everyone so came, much. like that was so fun. One of my favourite, like I feel like they're all probably going to be like nights out because like, yeah. <laughs> I'm big <laughs> No, but one of my favourite nights slash days out was Amy's birthday yes. in second year. So funny. We went day oh, drinking, it was bank holiday as well, like it was just like that so That was so fun. fun. Like, just all so her fun. friends were here, like all of us, like, yeah. like it was so good. What are our favourite memories with uni? Neef. MSA nights are always MSA, they're like fucking memories. Yeah, you know what? Like, it's not even the nights out as well, it's the nights in. Like, we yeah. always say. Yeah. No, yeah. do you know what yeah. one of my funniest fucking memories is? That afters where I just was like, we went out into the hallway and then I was just like, where are we? <laughs> <laughs> we're like, well, we're not at your house. And I was the like, whole time. No. Nope. Well, one of my favourites, I mean, my Irish dancing show. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, that was good. Yeah. And then we'd all go out yeah. after. That no, I'm really sorry, good. the tab in general. The tab. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Monday night. Monday the night. Tab, Monday tab night. meeting, then Spontaneous you do the quiz. Pub quiz. You do the quiz. And then it'd be like, right, back to your guys, your guys' yeah. house. And then we'd be like, let's go out. Yeah, so at least you make it. funny memories to count, to be honest, ladies. That's, yeah, a, good one. that's a good question, though. What about like one piece of advice you'd give to someone going to uni? Oh, that is good. Cool. Cool. Yeah, yeah, that's good. Because uh, I was just thinking, like, I would say to someone, like, don't ever say no to anything because yeah, you're not going to remember yeah, yeah. the essay. Or, like, mm. obviously, you want to do well at uni and, like, you're not going to remember the night that you didn't do anything. Unless you've you got remember. an essay due at 10 a.m. and you haven't written it. Yeah, yeah. Then never say no to but, like, anything. sometimes so. I would say no to stuff and then, like, now I look back and I'm like, oh, I should have just said yeah. yeah. I remember in first year, we'd go, like, downstairs to pre or whatever in our pajamas and, like, be like, oh, we're not coming out, we're just going to come to freeze. And then, like, five minutes in, you're like, I'm going to go get changed. <laughs> I, I kind of yeah. get that when people say, like, even just, like, Generally, like not just about a uni, and they're like, I'll just come for pre's. I'm like, it's yeah, so but cool. if they're Why having pre's downstairs, pre's? like no, the no, boys no, I mean, like, not a uni set. It's to say you don't know, you're um, not in time with your mates at home. Yeah. And someone's like, I'm just gonna come for pre's. So you're gonna so drink, yeah. get, get all dressed up, up, get all dressed up, and then not come out. Like, yeah. There's no point in even coming then. Just no, come out. Please. The amount like we used to go out in third year. Like we used to go like three, four times a week. I spend time with my Well, actually, we won't because it's Newcastle. You just go so it was true. So. Yeah. Peace of advice, never say no. Unless like you really want to have a stay, but like if you just no. want to get an early night in, that's why. Yeah, like, don't, don't, don't. don't. Yeah, if you want an early night. Although sometimes you, want... you need to like have a bit of time off. Also, also, work hard, play hard. Like go to like do your work, do your essays, but also like don't be made to feel guilty for like going uh, out. No, like, I'd so rather go to uni and get a two one or a two two and have yeah. made memories of having a lot. Also, if you miss a few lectures like that, they would try and make you feel quite guilty for it, but like honestly it's not that deep. Like no, yeah. one bit of advice okay. I would say is everyone puts this kind of like pressure on like Meeting your best mates in the first week. Yeah, and meeting yeah. your husband. All this. <laughs> Actually, <laughs> like, we'll be in third year, like, well, where's our husband? <laughs> but, like, you'll just, like, you'll find. You naturally along the way sort of congregate thing. with people you're similar to, don't yeah. you? Yeah, it's just like a natural thing. Because you need such a big place, life. you get you will attract find it. You attract people that are like you. Yeah. Also, person. don't like feel too pressured to get a house too early because oh that just yeah. like, makes pressure, and then you don't want to end up living with people. People rush in, don't they? But if you could live in any other country other than like the UK, where would you choose? Right now, yeah. yeah. Or just or like no, actually no. That's one country that I've always wanted to visit, like my, the top. Out of all the countries I have to visit, the top one is Vietnam. Oh yeah, yes. I really want to go there. Unbelievable. Amazing. I would maybe live 
it's hard because like would you live somewhere where it's like english speaking because then that would like probably be quite like mm. Easier. Or would you just pick it up somewhere else or like that's the best way to learn it right? I think Thailand I would pick. I would probably pick Oh god I would that's easily I pick Australia because as well, like right now, they don't even seem to have any sort of lockdown. Yeah, true. I, mean? yeah. I would yeah, maybe true. the Gilly Islands in Bali. Oh, oh my god, actually yeah, maybe. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh my god. Can, like do you paradise. think that's like a place you could actually live then or is it more of like not a full place? time? Not forever. Not forever. Definitely. Definitely. But you like, like live there for a bit, yeah. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, it's like especially Gilly Tea, there's so much going on there. Yeah. It's just beautiful. Get like a cool job working in a bar. Yeah. yeah. Or a hostel or something. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Love that. Mine what, would be Scotland. What was your answer mm -hmm. it? Um there's loads of places that I want to visit, so I can't say I'd live there without visiting yeah, them. True. But I feel like Berlin would be a pretty cool place. Yeah, to live. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. yeah, like a Europe or like Paris. Yeah. I'd love to live there. Yeah. Like if we're actually thinking about close to home. I just think there's so many places in the world that like I just wanna see. Oh yeah. That sounds exist. so generic, but like Yeah, definitely. Okay, so, someone else has said uh, First thing you're gonna do when COVID is finally like not oh existing. Night out, night out, yeah. night out in Newcastle. Yeah, where we going? Right, night. So where we going? Picture the scene. Picture the scene. We sat here getting ready. We sat here, no. Boris Johnson does a speech at 12 p.m. <laughs> on a Saturday, like lunchtime, and goes, <laughs> "He's got to give us tan." No, he's got to give us pre warning I need to get me tan in. Boris yeah, yeah, yeah. He, he, he does it on the. No, but we probably want to go on the night he gave us. Do you know what I mean? We won't be like... Yeah, true. Yeah, it's lunchtime. I'm Morning, saying, no, okay, yeah. We said on Friday, I'm opening them on Saturday. Yeah. Young night, 6pm on his little speech. You're expecting him to impose another lockdown. And he goes, this is it, guys. Covid's oh. gone. Everything is back to normal. <laughs> uh, what do we do? So, we can... We go get our nails, our hair, oh, yeah. our lashes yeah. done. On the Saturday. We go get spring tan. Then. Yeah. Then we come back, we start getting ready at about 4 pm. Yeah. Oh my god, that's like sixth form vibes. Like, yeah. slow. You're like, like slow the whole day. Yeah, we probably film get ready with us, you know, first night ever back out. Ever. Then we'd ever. <laughs> um, and then we would ha get people, everyone around oh that we god. haven't seen, like from all over the country, everyone yeah. would come flocking to our house. All over the we'd world, have, All over the world, we'd have pre's. So we'd have to have like. So early. Let's start at seven. So and we turn up at nine. So it's basically a house party and a night like, out. Yeah, it's a house oh, party. Imagine. And then when it gets to like 10, 11, where are we going? We're going Hobo. Of yeah. course. And we go to Joe's. Yeah, Cozy Joe's. Cozy Joe's. 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 Nip to Soho just yeah. for a bit. For a and trip. Nostalgia. Yeah. yeah. And then have everyone back to our. For a massive oh, afters. Yeah. yeah. And we would just. Maybe you just have to keep going for like three days. <laughs> and then we'd get on a flight, like we'd have a week of like, Oh my God, yeah, I go away. Yeah. Have a week of party in a Newcastle with everyone. And then we'd all go on the like, holiday. holiday. And then we'd go from Imagine. there to like travel the world. I just realized I've baked and I'm gonna sit like this. Great. Bacon. Yeah, I, know, I'm just baking. I really like bacon. Bacon with flour and stuff. Bacon with flour and stuff. Oh my God, do you know what's the best lipstick I've ever used ever? Quantella's MAC Creme de Nude. <gasps> yeah. Right, so I would have the MAC lipsticks. Everyone like raved and I did used to have them, but like I always felt like they didn't stay on my lips. They're quite drying as well. Mm. Is this a brush? Mine. But I feel like no lipstick really stays on mine. Eve's just, just on the telephone, as always. Popular girl. Yeah, should we play the most likely game? Like, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I'll do ones it. that we didn't do. <laughs> okay. <gasps> Sorry, another bit. I, don't, I can't remember which ones we did and didn't do. Which of us is more likely to be talked into signing up for a monthly subscription they don't want? Three, two, one, Hannah. <laughs> True. I was going to say, should we do a shot again if you get all oh, four yeah. votes? Oh, we're going to start after this one. one. Well, should we not do that? Well, I want to get drunk. Same. Okay, right. Which of us is more likely to be constantly correcting other people's grammar? Three, two, two one, Hannah. Oh. oh, I'm really bad at oh, doing actually, it because yeah, I've got no, a little brother. Me. I, I, do, do, I, do, yeah. I do it in my head all the time. <laughs> I know that is the yeah, I feel like most of us though, because were well, you guys all were editors? Like, people, like I'm not that was your job. I'm just standing around. That's your degree. Yeah, true. <laughs> <laughs> Money well spent. Where is that? Secondary yeah. You get a spag mark. Yeah. What was that spelling? Spelling, punctuation, grammar. You get five marks per paper. Oh, yeah. 
<laughs> this is a funny one. Okay. Which of us is most likely to be the office gossip? <laughs> oh. uh, three, three, two, two one, me and you. I love a good office gossip. I feel like we all, we all love yeah, a good yeah, office gossip. Yeah, I feel like that'd be all. And now they're all working and said me. me. <laughs> yeah, but I feel like you would be a, a gossip, but you, I'd like come to you and be like, oh, you never guess what. But then that's me being yeah. a gossip, isn't it? Yeah, you're, you are a gossip. Right, no, I am. We all are gossip. Oops. I'm not a gossip in the sense of like, he's a bitch. No, yeah, yeah, just yeah, like, yeah, no. It's oh, we're nosy, we want to know we are, yeah, we yeah. Yeah. Which of us is most likely to ask to speak to the manager? <laughs> three, three, two, two one, one, me. <laughs> me? I, I would actually do better. I'd be like, yeah, he's tall like between you and Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I told me and me My mum's not a Karen, but if the food's shit and she's paying for it, she'll say to them, I'm paying, like, and she won't be mean about it, but she'll be like, Look like, can you do something about yeah, it? Yeah. I mean, which I think is fair. If you're paying for your food and it's shit, you need to like say yeah. something, don't you? Which of us is most likely to ghost what? someone they're dating? Mm. Sorry, Sorry go what did you ghost say? someone they're dating. I think ghosting's a bit cruel. Yeah. yeah. Don't ghost. Um. Okay. Three, Three two, two, one. one Eve. Eve. Yeah. <laughs> which of us is more likely to buy new socks rather than do the laundry? Three, two, one, Hannah. <laughs> Wait, did we all say Hannah? Yeah. yeah. Oh, sure. Yeah. Yeah. We, so we said all said Vast one as well, actually. So we didn't. Did no, we didn't. I don't remember that one. We did. I just remember me and you. No, we're going with Hannah, shots. I can see you in each other. Not stupid. <laughs> Wait, what are we Wait. shotting? Um, we can do my happy falls. Oh, I don't really know if I want to do that to be honest. Well, well you're the one that came well, up with it. Yeah, and then Frank declined the offer. Exactly. Now, exactly. now exactly. it's me. It's convenient. Are there any shot glasses? In there. No. No. Oh, we should have drunk out of our new glasses. And I thought that, but then it's like more of a. Wait, just, just check in the oh, cupboard. Oh, if, in if there's anything more like shot suitable than vodka, I don't know if I can have that right now. Oh, right. This scares me a little bit, I can't lie, because did you ever used to drink Epic for summer berries? Yeah. Like, shit. That was like our first shit. Me. That was, we would always go and get a bottle of Echo Falls each. Yeah. Drink that, freeze, and then we'd go out and have drinks. Wait, Echo Falls. No, we don't go to the first year. Echo Falls is like six one. Echo Falls is six one for me, yeah. To move a vodka oh in God. To move a vodka in the first year. Smell that. This no, honestly, like... Echo Falls, like summer berries, like smell makes it. me feel a bit sick. Don't smell it. Don't smell it. It smells, it smells like juice. Summer berries. Wine. No, when I have already drink, you have if like you drink that. That's so weird because it's Echo Falls summer berries. Oh god! If you drink that with lemonade, that. right? It just tastes like juice. Yeah, true. Ooh. Brad, Vicky, don't actually. I'm being serious. I'm, I'm being serious. She's being serious. serious. I'm not trying to offend. Before her. when she said it, she was joking, but now she's being serious. I'm being serious. I'm not trying to offend her. So when you spit, that. my ears are ringing. That's fair. That's fair. <laughs> no, 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 no. I'll do that. That's so. Wow. Neve's like. I'm pen to the bees coming at you with a round. Cheers. Mm. And you still want to try it voluntarily. <laughs> no, I got voted for... <laughs> what one? I can't remember. Oh, for the ghosting, yeah. Ghosting. That's disgusting, man. Yeah. Which of us is most likely to try and flirt their way out of a speeding ticket? <laughs> Three, Three, two, two one, pass. Oh. Put it out of there, Neve. Sorry, but that is something I would do. <laughs> Legend. Which of us is more likely to crash a party? Three, Three two, two, one, one Neve. Oh. <laughs> oh. I think we all do that. Yeah, we probably all. No, I'd probably be invited. <laughs> yeah, but I'd be the one that wasn't invited and we just fucking turn up. <laughs> Me, not Hannah Williams. Which of us is less likely to admit they're wrong? Least likely. I don't know if it's less. Least. Three, Three two, two, one, pass. Oh. oh! Who did you say that? Oh, I didn't say one. Oh, <laughs> that's not how the game works, is it? <laughs> I was like, doing my roles, I was like thinking and then I didn't think in time. So that's a shot. So that's, that's a shot. shot. Yeah. Because you vote for yourself. No, I didn't vote. But you probably would have Exactly, and that's yourself. a forfeit because you didn't vote. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I can see a shot coming! I, not a lot. Oh, yeah. Plus, I've got work at half seven. Cool, it's a It's my last ever shift, though, so. It is my last ever shift. <laughs> Oh, 
<laughs> Cheers. Cheers. Cheers, girlies. Cheers. Here's to being players. Who are we? Who are we? Okay, guys. Which of us is most likely to. <laughs> these are funny. Which of us is most likely to recline their seat all the way back on a plane? <laughs> Three, two, two one, one Hannah. Oh. oh, thank God for that. Well, thank you so much for watching this Get Ready With Us. Thank if you. you've enjoyed seeing me, even if it's a channel, up, subscribe, bell, subscribe, comment yeah. below. Right, so right, we'll, we'll see you in our next video. Yes, whatever it might be. Mm. Bye. Bye.